everyone, how are you? Today we're going to teach you how to make the traditional chicken coxinha, which is a typically Brazilian savory and very tasty. I want to remind you that the ingredients are listed in the video description. For this recipe, we're going to use the water we used to cook the chicken breast. We'll use 4 cups of 250 milliliters of this water to make the coxinha dough. We'll also add 4 cups of whole milk and, if you prefer, 2 chicken bouillon cubes to give more flavor to the dough. However, the coxinha will still be tasty even if you don't add the bouillon. Add salt to taste and 1 cup of 200 milliliters of soybean oil, or corn oil if you don't have soybean oil. Don't use olive oil. Bring the mixture to a boil over medium heat, and then add 1 kilogram of wheat flour all at once. Stir constantly until the dough becomes consistent, which is very important. Now, our dough is ready. First, we're going to knead the dough well. I've already greased the table where I'm going to roll out the dough, which is still a little warm. But you can knead the dough while it's still warm using a spoon, or you can use a rolling pin to stretch it out. Let's start kneading, and remember that it's important to knead well because this is the secret to making the dough crispy. Keep kneading until the dough doesn't stick to your hands anymore and the process becomes perfect. Let's make a big worm here, I don't know if that's the correct expression, but you should stretch the dough and then cut it the way you see here in the video, and now we'll shape it again. We'll take the right portion to start making the chicken coxinhas, and we'll cut it to this size so it becomes much more practical, because it will already be in the standard size. If you're enjoying the video, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, share it with your friends, and don't forget to activate the notifications. Now we're going to start shaping the dough. Look, you take this position and make a hole in the middle, put it in the palm of your hand, and then make a hole in the middle, and keep opening the hole, opening it and shaping it at the same time from the inside. Look, it's like a coxinha now. It fits perfectly in the palm of your hand, and you're going to put your preferred filling here, remembering that the filling is chicken with corn, but you can use other fillings of your choice. Now you're going to close your coxinha, take it with your fingertips like this, and shape it. Now we're going to bread the chicken coxinhas, and for that, we'll use a bowl of water and a bowl of breadcrumbs or bread flour. Dip the coxinha in the water and then in the breadcrumbs and place it on the tray to rest. Remember that if you want to freeze them, do it on the tray and then you can put them in a plastic bag to store. For this recipe we made, the ingredients used were enough to make almost 100 chicken coxinhas. Now let's fry the coxinhas, which should be done in hot soybean or corn oil. Here are the delicious chicken coxinhas, beautiful and tasty. I hope you enjoyed learning how to make the delicious and traditional chicken coxinhas.